Hi guys, so I'm here with another video. Um, tonight's is gonna be a haul. It's from Ulta and Sephora, and I hope you enjoy. So let's jump right in. We have, well, let me show you the bag first. I had a little uh, fun splurge on the two stores a couple days ago. Let's jump it all out. Um, let's see. We'll start off with I got the um beauty blender. This is what it looks like. I've heard like rave reviews about it. I really like it. It's really, let me take it with the packaging. It's really soft and uh, the dupes, I've, I think I tried like another dupe before, like uh, maybe a few weeks ago. I really didn't like it, but there's nothing that compares to this. It's used, so excuse the dirtiness, but uh, it's squishy and when you wet it, it doubles in size and it gets right into the corners for concealer. Use the other side for um, foundation. When it's uh, not wet, fits right in the packaging. And when it's wet, let's just dry it either on the tip or on the bottom. That's that. I also invested in the Mia 2 Clarisonic. I really like this. My skin is honestly like tightened up. The pores are smaller. I've had it for maybe like three weeks now. And I've been using it, and I, I forget which brush head. I, I got the, uh, it was like a limited color. It's like hot pink. I mean, and Sephora. Uh, I got like a free, like, uh, the interchangeable head. I'm not sure which one this is. This is the one it came with. I mean, it's been working pretty well. So, that's that. I also got, let's see, the um, Too Faced, the Return of Sexy palette. And that's what it looks like. And the colors are right on the back. And it comes with the Too Faced Shadow Insurance and the Waterproof Eyeliner. The eyeliner I really like. It stays on your tight line, the bottom or the top, all day without touching up. I'll show you guys what the palette looks like. I think it's really pretty try to open it because usually I can't open this right away oh my god it's taking forever okay so here are the colors if you guys can see that's what it looks like it's like in three different sections with you know a highlight contour color um blending you know everything's beautiful I've done this eye a purple eye and a smoky eye I really like it I can do like a separate review if you guys want on the palette itself and the different I looks you can achieve it does come with like three different like looks that you can do I've done them all I really like it and they're shimmery if you're not a fan of shimmer you might not like it but it's really not that shimmery when I put it on so I'm a fan of either matte or shimmer so for me I don't really care I also invested in well not really that expensive but the Real Techniques brushes I really love these this is the Real Techniques powder brush I mean you can really you know it's so big you can fluff everything out I use this with the stay matte rimmel I do wear foundation which is once in a while I also have the stippling brush which I really like to get the foundation in if I'm not if my beauty blender is dirty or want to switch it off once in a while um I also got uh, I saw this when I was checking out actually. It's the little benefit professionals in that gal. Um, that gal is like somewhere in my house. I have no idea, but I've been using the pore professionals. It's amazing. My pores are big. I am acne prone I mean, my skin doesn't look too bad right now. That thinks the Clarisonic. But the professionals really fills in your pores and your makeup is like flawless. Um, this is the Too Faced Shadow Insurance that came with the um, Return of Sexy palette. I've used it. I really like it. No complaints about that. Um, the Stay Matte from I got in the Translucent. I really like this no complaints so far it keeps me matte throughout the day if I wear foundation I wouldn't wear, I don't really wear foundation too much but I use the um L'Oreal true match I think it's like n 5.5 it's like a new shade I use that and this on top keeps me matte most of the day maybe put it on like once I don't really wear it that much but I do like this one That's what it looks like 
Let's see. I also got. I heard. Uh, let's see. A lot of people talking about this. It's the uh, Smooth Skin NYC Bronzing Face Powder, and the color is Sunny. It is 720A Sunny, and it comes with a little sponge. I don't really use that. So I put it on the side. This reminds me of Too Faced, um, the Chocolate Soleil, I think it is. Um, it's very pretty, I mean, I mean, you guys can't really see that, but it's a very pretty bronzy color. And I also got the Dream Lumi in Radiant. It's a little, um, you know, you uh, crank it up put it right I usually put it right in here a little bit on the nose chin up on the forehead it gives you a nice highlight got some nail polish from Sally Hansen hard as nails extreme wear in golden 485 um, right now I have some gel nail polish it's kind of coming off but it's in gel I think it's purple the color and I think that's about that's about does it for my haul. I'll have more stuff coming, obviously. Um, the stuff I have, I pretty much like. I can do like a favorites video, or I can do tutorials on the Too Faced Return of Sexy palette. Whatever you guys want to see. Because again, as I said in my first video, I'm about you know you guys give me feedback, and I can do videos that you want to see. I have a skincare routine down right now, including the Keller Sonic. I have a mascara routine. Um, some, you know, hair care products that I can do. So I really, I'm really into this and I really want to get my channel out there. So this is my second video. So hopefully you guys, you can thumbs up, like, subscribe if you like it. Hopefully you do. All right. I love you guys. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.